A new gym in Great Falls is taking an old school approach to lifting weights. The owners and gym members say it can make a powerful difference. There you go. Rude dogs. R-A-U-D, Estonian for iron, steel. The name of Mike LaFountain's Rude Dogs Gym may have Northern European roots, but its mission is pure powerlifting. It's not a fitness center, it's just hardcore come in here and lift. When other gyms that offered powerlifting closed or announced they were moving and abandoning free weights, Mike and his longtime friend and co-owner Dave Dunlop came up with the idea. As a matter of fact, this building's owned by my neighbor. So and you'd heard him passing that he was trying to rent a place. So it just all just kind of come together all at once. And, and then three months later, here we are. The gym is located at 322 6th Street South. Mike says Great Falls was once a hotbed for powerlifting but the numbers have dwindled. And that's one of the things we're, we're hoping to do here is bring in some of Great Falls High's athletes and CMR's athletes and create that team that represents Great Falls. And if we get the teams big enough, the schools can represent themselves. Their building offers something many commercial gyms don't. Big guys banging a lot of weights is, is, is wears out equipment, makes a lot of noise, is very distracting, and they, they, they discourage. That. And we're, we're encouraging that here. In addition to starting powerlifting teams, the pair hopes to give young athletes an outlet for off-season training. They say power is the base of all sports. We wouldn't train a football player the same as we would a, a swimmer. We wouldn't train a, a wrestler the same as we would a sprinter. Results are starting to show. Mike says one of his lifters has already lost almost 60 pounds and 16 inches off his waist. From beginner to advanced, all are welcome not just for the powerlifting aspect, but the self-improvement as well. Whether that's having bigger shoulders and or a bigger squat the next week, or whether that's having the self-discipline to, even when you're having a hard day, still being a nice and courteous person, which, believe it or not, this teaches. This is not just for us, this is for our community. This is to get kids off the street, you know? keep them out of trouble, keep them from doing drugs and getting into fights and violent crimes and going to jail. You know, you could take all that aggression out in here. We have more information on hours and pricing on our website. In Great Falls, Tim McGonigal, MTN News.